Hi, my name is Lily and I'm going to show you how to create a presentation in Disney in just 5 minutes. Start by creating a new project with the big blue button on the upper left corner of your dashboard. Here you can select what kind of content you want to create, be it a presentation, an infographic or any other visual content. For now, click on presentations and choose the style of templates you want to work with. Choosing classic will give you a selection of more traditional, PowerPoint-like slides, while the modern ones are more fresh, contemporary visuals, the kind of style you are most probably seeing in digital design today. Let's go ahead and choose modern. Once in the editor, you will find hundreds of pre-designed visual blocks or layouts that can help you create professional-looking slides in no time. Just click Add Slide in the upper right corner and quickly drag and drop the blocks that you need for your presentation to the panel on the right hand side. It already has a title slide, but you can change it to any other if you prefer. Then delete this existing one with the little gear icon. And then I will add an intro slide, an agenda, one that explains the services that our company offers, And then let's finish it with a contact slide. Now that you have the basic structure for your presentation, let's make the color theme reflect your company's brand colors. Click on the theme colors button on the toolbar on the left hand side. Here you can pick a theme that works for you, which will then be applied to the entire presentation. Or if you need to be very specific with the colors of your company, there's an option to set that up too. In Visme, whatever you select on the canvas will bring up relevant options in the top menu bar. So if you click on any colored blocks on the canvas, it will bring up the option to change its settings. Just click on this little colored box in the upper left corner, click plus and type in the value that you need. To replace a color all around the presentation, select an object with that color, change its color and then tick replace all. Once you're happy with the colors, let's replace the pre-made blocks with your actual content. Click to select the text and type in your own title and subtitle. There are hundreds of Google fonts for you to use and personalize your presentation. For images, there are a few different ways to replace existing content. For background images, you can replace it with an image from your computer by double-clicking on the background, then click Upload Background. To match the image style to the rest of the presentation, click Filter and add a color overlay. The color overlay will add a tint to your image, which is a great way to make all images look unified within your presentation. If you're lacking high-quality images on your computer, you also have the option to browse our vast library of high-quality, royalty-free images, courtesy of the amazing Unsplash. You can search by keyword, or just drag any image you like onto the canvas. This will give you two options. If you drop it on the upper half of the canvas, it will be added as a background image, while if you drop it on the bottom, it will be added as a normal image. So for now, go ahead and drop it on top. To make the icons in the template reflect your message, just select the icon and click Replace icon. This will bring up the replacement options the software thinks relevant, but you can also search for whatever you need. Clicking on the one you like will automatically replace the icon on the canvas, adapting its colors to your theme. With this basic skill set, you should now be able to go through the entire template and just fill in all the blanks. You can of course create slides from scratch as well. Just add a blank slide and use these ready-made blocks on the left-hand side. Drag a title onto the slide and add whatever content you need. Click on Stats and Figures to insert our one-of-a-kind data widgets, fully customizable and fully intuitive. Clicking on data will offer you all kinds of tools that allow you to easily edit data in an effective visual way. Once all your content is in place, click share in the upper right corner. Select publish for web, give your presentation a title and a description if needed, then hit publish to the web. This link now is shareable with anyone, no need for a Visme account to view it. You can also share your presentation privately if you want only specific people to have access to it. This link can be password protected as well. You can also embed the Visme presentation to any website or blog or download it to present offline. Click download in the upper right corner and select PDF or HTML file. The PDF will give you a static high quality image with each slide on a different page, while the HTML file also allows you to present the interactive parts of your presentation. To see your final product, hit preview and enjoy!